All right. So it looks like we are live. Let me switch over to streaming. Okay. All right. So Auth. Yeah, I've, I have never played this game before, but I've definitely heard of it. Um, it should be fun. Let's uh, let's go ahead and boot it up. Over here. Okay. Start a new game. Actually, how does this look on... Okay, yeah. Seems fine when OBS is end. Let's get started. Okay. Translation team would like to dedicate this third and final version of the English off translation to the memory of Felix the Judge. Uh -huh. Caution. It is possible that certain scenes in this game may prove shocking to an unwarned public, or maybe not. Um, okay. The soundtrack and sound effects of Off, created by alias Conrad Coldwood, are an important part of the game. It would be a shame to play without them. Okay. Unproductive fun time. And to your name. Hmm. All right. Are we naming the uh, the character, or or is this like the player's name? Um, we'll just go with the. Uh, we'll just go with my Twitch name, I guess. Let's see, where is? Oh, it's Z. Okay. Maybe this is for naming your save file. Oops. Okay. There we go. Yes. All right. Welcome. I'm assigned to a being called the Batter. The Batter is on a mission. Be sure that it's accomplished. We'll let you both out in Zone Zero. Good luck. For more information, find the one called the Judge. Move my body for it. Use the arrow keys on your keyboard. Okay. Drag the environment. Use the space bar or the enter key. Okay. A space bar, huh? Um, doesn't seem to be anything here. Zone zero. Okay. There we go. There cannot be any living beings in Zone Zero, hence I deduce that you are a pure figment of my imagination. Nevertheless, I will introduce myself. I am the judge, and I am aching to know your name, dear illusory interlocutor. I am the batter. I have been entrusted with a sacred mission. It is a pleasure, though it was not the body I was addressing, but the soul that it harbors. What is your name, controller? Her name is Ruby, she can't talk. Well, yeah, technically not. Hey, pass. Um, how have you been today? Where she can see and hear everything. Even though you two are but an imaginary specter in my eyes, let it be said that I'm delighted to meet you as well, dear. Okay. I believe we need your help. I guess with that cat, um, that's the judge. I don't know why they're called the judge, but they are. Many people are in need of my services, you know. Everybody loves cats. Put themselves against their legs and purr in a most insistent manner. They adore that. Not talking about that kind of help. What sort of service could I offer to an ectoplasmic entity? I have a sacred mission to fulfill. I must purify the world. There's no objective more laudable than yours. I accept to serve. I accept to serve you as a guide through this area if it is of any help to you. Okay. Um, looks like there's some boxes here. A luck ticket has been found. Okay. It's impossible to get around that obstacle. Okay. Um, 
What is this room? Quite peculiar. Yeah, you're telling me. Four four eight two eight seven C. Um. Well, that didn't seem to do anything. Object. Oh, that's what that does. Okay, it's a healing item. Competence. The batter, level 1, pure. HP, 120. Combat tower? 43. Game looks like cheese. Yeah, it kind of does. Or maybe it's just that this area is very yellow. Waiting. Active. What is this? Status. Okay. Health points. Competency points? I'm not sure what that is. 69 attack. Um... Let's see, name the batter, class savior, nickname purifier, state pure. This weapon is a herald bat. Okay. I'm not sure what this room is, so let's continue up here. Let me know for a minute, but you're quite tangible for a phantasmagorical being. Might you in fact be a person of flesh and blood? I think so. When I was mistaken from the beginning, not even about me. Fanciful phantasms. It was relatively bizarre, I must say, if you are the first living being I was given to encounter in this place. I had incidentally concluded that Zone Zero was an empty land. It was all too obvious that I was led astray. However, there exist other zones, and in those territories, hostile individuals might attack you most violently. Your sacred mission will likely lead you into these lands. Would you like me to acquaint you with the art of violent confrontation? Um... Yeah, sure. Let's uh, see what the combat of this game is about. Purification in progress. So placed at the right hand side of the screen. Okay. Component will be placed on the left. Mm -hmm. At the beginning, let's see, choice leaves empty. to you. Decide between attack and auto. Attack allows you to fight in classical fashion. Auto is your choice. Computer will make those three decisions in your place. Okay, I see. Sure. Alright, let's attack. Now that both the level of the battery and the fun determine the impact of your assaults. Computer your adversaries so they avoid the offensive moves you'll exchange. On occasion, your concrete, concrete will may allow you to release a critical strike, causing teeth to fly in heaps. Let us proceed if you are willing to. In those of you first chose attack upon selecting the batter, a new window opened itself at the lower right-hand corner of the screen. There you have a choice between four new options. Attack lets you carry out a soul strike and likewise soul adversary. Competence permits you to use one of your special talents. Objects lets you access the inventory you are presently carrying. Finally, flee is the option of the coward. While I toward from this alternative, note that only the batter may select it in his personal menu. I attempt to utilize an item. Take a select ticket and previously use it on the batter's person. Okay. Oh, they gave us another luck ticket. Okay. Um, let's see. Impeccable. Hmm. One thing we have not yet addressed, and what's that? Competences, okay. The powerful attacks which they induce a resurgence of health points. Any use of competences leads to consumption of competence points. You also use your skills with parsimony. Once, you, once your points are consumed, it will be impossible to carry out heavy assaults. If some mischance happen to cross swords with tough opponent for recovering some points, your victory will be uncertain. Let us try right away. Choose confidence and try using wide angle, which will allow you to analyze your enemy. Wide angle. The judge, a cryptic feline of odd appearance. HP, the number of competency 30, no weaknesses or resistances. <laughs> so about the art of combat. About the wide angle. Okay. Maximally analyze adversaries you've already knocked down for a long time. Combination ends and health wins your game or all of your opponents fall to zero. 
Maybe never helps when a successful career in purification. From now on, you'll be ready to dispose of all impure obstacles that dare appear in your luminous mission's way. Supposing your intelligence is on the same level with your unethical capability of dealing bat blows to an innocent cat. <laughs> be it as it may, your training has not reached its end yet. Let me ask you to follow me if you still want me as your guide. Okay. Yeah, let's, uh... I'm still not sure what these numbers mean. <laughs> use your cerebral organ correctly. To use your cerebral organ correctly. You know, the one bathing flabbily in your cranium. Think of these floating blocks correspond, in some way or another, to the symbols you can see on the wall. Hmm. I think the weather's nice outside, okay. Oh, these are windows, okay. So... Oh, it's a puzzle, okay. Floating blocks correspond in some way or another to the symbols you can see on the wall, okay. One... Two. Okay, I see. And now there's more puzzles like this. Um, what do you have to say here? Is there a problem of your charming hero? You don't have everything in your place, I'm not your janitor after all. Nonetheless, may I perhaps dare suggest you try to activate some of these floating blocks more than once, if so required? <laughs> Resolve me this intriguing obstacle and post haste, if you please. Wish to rejoin the ground floor as soon as possible. Okay. Go one, two. Wait, was that the wrong one? Hmm. Okay, how do you do this one? Two, six, um, eight, two, three. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. Finally, after all that effort, long awaited reward makes its entrance to the scene. It's cat food? It's cat food. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. Those numbers from before. Like... Hold on. There was another room with a wall of numbers. Let me... let me go back to that real quick. Okay. 448287. And then what is this? C? Four four eight two eight seven. Let, let me let me remember that. In fact, let me let me type it. Let me uh, type this in chat real quick. Four four eight two eight seven. C. There we go. Okay. Let's go back to that to puzzle above, or, or below rather. Okay. Four, four, okay. Eight, two, eight, seven. This is C, I guess? Okay. What is this? Here we have an accessory that will prove especially useful to your purifying quest, dear enlightened student and sportive friend. It is a cube floating in the air, as you've probably noticed. Nevertheless, you'll be able to differentiate it from its ilk by the contrast of its clashing colors, assaulting your gaze with bad taste and defying any sensible course of plastic arts. Do not judge it too quickly, however, for despite its criticizable appearance, this red cube is of undeniable use. Aside from restoring the entirety of your health and competence points, it is capable of saving your progress and sending you to the nothingness. Okay, it's a safe block. I see. 
Nothingness is a place of transition outside of space itself, where you can travel from one point to another at the speed of light. I invite you to try for yourself in order to discover locations more populous in this deserted land. Open your wings, my dear companion, and fly towards the following zones without hesitation. The only enemy is the fear that will grab you. Okay. Do not worry yourself. I too travel between different zones of the world. Perhaps we will come to meet again. By the by, take this. The item of the curious name will be the key that shall permit you to enter zone 1. If I clarified, you can at any moment consult your inventory characteristics by using the es pressing the escape key. The Leo card has been found. Okay. Open's confidence. Mine's completely restored. Let's save game. Block. Okay. How many, s how many save files does this give you? Uh, 15. Okay. We'll save in block one. <laughs> Considering what kind of game this is, it might be it might be best to like uh, save multiple times. I'll worry about that later, though. Using the floating cube behind you. Um. Okay. I guess we return to the nothingness. Yes. Um. World map. Okay. Um, there's some voices. Zone two? Oh, okay, I see. That's zone zero. This is zone one. It's, it's a tree. Okay. The room. Uh. The, the room in dark red text. Yeah, I don't I don't know about that one. Let's let's go back to zone zero real quick. I think there was something we missed. Yeah. Let's Oh, we can open this now. A piece of s silver flesh. Uh Okay. Let's be safe here, and back to the nothingness. All right, let's go to zone one. Now it's green. It's another safe block. We'll save here. Okay. Um, what do we got here? Tramway number one is a very useful means of transport to get to the different different areas of zone one. Okay. Select your destination. Damien. I guess we're going to Damien. Zone one. Tramway number two hasn't been coming for a long time. Hmm. Right, what's in... A visitor. The smoke mines? The batter. Prophet or a man of belief. Something like that. Nobody. Superior personnel. Okay, what do we got here? Here in the smoke mines of Damien, in the south of zone number one. Hmm. Here we send laborers into deep tunnels to unearth metal from the ground, freeing trapped smoke from the depths. Using various tools, you put some of it into bottles, which, which the Queen sends to the other zones. Uh, 
rest of it flows free and forms the air that our lungs inhale and exhale. Uh, so we can live. It's an essential element, the first among the four elements. Hmm. Because without smoke, people would have nothing to breathe. Well, there we are. So, well, uh, how do I put this? Where are the impures? <laughs> yes, there we go. There are many specters in the mines. They're getting more and more aggressive. But, uh, in fact, it would be good if you wouldn't go there, because the regulations forbid access to the smoke mines for visitors. So uh, here's what we're going to do. There's an annex tunnel that nobody ever goes to. But a miner went in there some time ago. He saw something strange, he said. Nothing like the usual. So I thought, maybe that's the leader of the Spectres. Uh, so, there we are. If you accept, you'll go into the Annex Mine and kill the leader of the Spectres. The Spectres will disappear and we can work properly again. There we go. There we... Uh, do you have any questions? No. <laughs> Great. Impeccable. The tunnel is right down there. Me, I will wait for you here. Okay. I guess we're going down. It's the cat again. <laughs> Jumping Jack? To be the Spectre's leader? Certainly not. Only passing through, not unlike the smokers being extracted from this pale, metallic place. I believe I know where the one you take for an ectoplasm can be found. It's a ring? To tell the truth, I am perplexed. I think it is one of those peculiar things called a spherical add-on. Very well tried to appropriate it, but the operation systematically failed. But I'm thinking, maybe you, one who is not of physical matter, will perhaps succeed in binding the spiritual entity to yours. Uh, okay. Add-on Alpha has joined you. Especially intriguing phenomenon. I submit that I remain perplexed by this unexpected metaphysical reaction. Fair enough. Since it has decided to accompany you, I know only to advise you to make the best possible use of it. Got it. Leader of the Spectres isn't here. Apologies, but I fear I have to respond in the negative. This add-on aside, I have not crossed paths with a single moving soul in this place. Hey, Mango. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, I, I have... I've never seen a a lot of this game before. This is this is my first time playing it. So what do I tell this guy? Returns, have you killed the uh leader of the Spectres? No. It wasn't there. Oh, really? I bugger, crap. I well then uh I believe it I'll have to let you in let you enter into the main gorges then. But um Regulations are against it. All right, uh, I, I suppose this is a very special case, as stated in paragraph five. So, uh, good. Well, the main mines are on the right. There. Oh, okay. There are phantoms down there. They keep us from working properly. But this is my break time anyway. What are you doing here? Are you part of the mine inspection personnel? Spectres, that's good news. So where are the Spectres, anyway? Phantoms in all the tunnels. You enter here, no regulations prohibit external visitors. I have always working the endmost corridors. Since everything is the same around here, it's easy to get lost. Alright, um... Is this another safe block? Show yourselves, corrupted children. I'm the voice of forgiveness that'll eliminate... that'll eliminate your ill-fated forms. Prepare yourselves to receive my judgment. Uh... Oh, here we go. It's pepper steak time. Yeah, 
I, I've definitely heard this song before. Yeah, plenty of times. I think, I think this is what got me interested in playing this game. Nice. Adversaries purified. 400 XP gained. 80 credits received. Luck ticket received. Nice. Um, we're just getting a bunch of luck tickets. Okay. This add-on is fighting by my side. That's useful. Let's purify the other galleries. Indeed. Yellow blocks don't allow you to return to the nothingness. Okay. Pepper Steak is a great battle theme. Yeah, it really is. Block grants the access to the deeper bowels. Okay. Let's see. Is there anything this way? Oh, random encounter. Chronic migraine. There's an off fan game called One that uses a sped up version of another track as the battle theme. Oh, I see. Hmm. I may check that one out at some point. Alright, what's this? A Joker has been found. What's this Joker? Revives a character. Okay. One is really good. Ah, so I hear. I'm working. I'm being productive. Okay. You say so. Is there anything else here? There's another. Oh, random encounter. Chronic migraine. I don't get what that's supposed to do. Series purified. Alpha reached level two. Saturated string has been acquired. What is this? Um. Oh, there's the Leo card. Doesn't show the. Uh... Oh well. Two pieces of Belial's meat have been found. Where are these? Saturated string is a competence. Oh, okay. Let's see. Competence. Oh, there's saturated string. Okay. Alright, gotcha. Is there anything else here? I think that's it. Yeah. We just go down now. What is this thing? Let's attack it. Domestic socket. Adversaries purified. Let's go. Oh, got another one. It's this thing again. Oh, shit. Okay. I need to heal a Alpha, I think. Let's attack. Nice. Um, there's a door. Seems to be locked from the inside. Oh. Well... Alright, but how do we... Progress them. Um, is there somewhere else I can go? Oh, 
Favorite part of off conferences is that you get them all the way up to level 45, and an average playthrough ends around like level 20 ish. Hmm. Do they have like a. I wonder if there were plans for like a, the game to be longer. Or for there to be a new game plus. Because if they can go up that high, it does sound like a, something like that was planned. Batter achieved level 3. Safe first base has been acquired. Doesn't seem to... Okay, so I already went that way. I guess I gotta check upwards? Well, I was already up here. I'm not quite sure where the game wants me to go. Hmm. Let's see. The purifying. Let's look around. Okay. So there's blocks over here. You gotta go up. All right. What? Did you come from the smoke mines? Yes. But it's full of specters in there. Yes. Are you a specter? No. And who are you? Have you been sent by the Queen? Or by Dadan? No. <laughs> but, but, you still know how to fight the Spectres? You, you could destroy them? Yes. Oh, that, that would be great. <laughs> they wish gave off in 2022? Yes. <laughs> it is... It is 2022. Must be the work of a Homestuck fan. <laughs> but... Uh, I mean, I mean, I wouldn't call myself a, a fan, but you know. Um, anyway, I'm in a Zoom meeting, so I will lurk. Have fun with the funny Homestuck adjacent game. Okay. Thank you for stopping by, Wish Cave. There, there are uh, specters in the large cow sheds. Cow sheds. Ah, uh, yes. Um, you are here at the metal farmsteads of Pentel, in the east of Zone 1. Our work consists of cutting livestock in two and extracting the metallic rocks contain- Rocks? What- what kind of cows are these? Cutting livestock in two and extracting the metallic rocks contained within the cadavers. Okay. All the metal of poor quality is discarded, forming the ground we walk on. The rest is purified and processed to create objects. A part of it is also put into crates and sent to the other zones, so they have objects in soil as well, I suppose. Or so they have objects in soil as well. Office really funny so it presents concepts like cows are the source of metal, like it's a completely normal thing to say. <laughs> yeah, I've I've gathered. I've certainly gathered that much. Uh, it's an essential element, the first among the four elements. 
uh, along with smoke, I guess. Because because you 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 breathe smoke and and you walk on on metal. Yeah. That's that's totally normal. Because without metal, people would have nothing to walk on. They would sink and drown. There. And so there are specters in the large cow sheds. I must purify the mines first. Yes, but the cow sheds aren't that big. And, uh, it would be good if you took care of them fast, because the Queen's inspector is going to arrive at any moment. So, please, could you do the cow sheds first? All right. <laughs> Great. Thank you. Thank you so much. The cow sheds are over there to the right. They aren't big at all, you'll see. It's going to be done super quickly. Okay. These balls are heaps of processed metal which are going to be sent to other zones. They're, uh, metallic. When, when to... You're, you're going to the destroy the specters. Okay. Yeah, we're expecting the Queen's inspector at any moment. It's important to pay close attention to the nutrition of the animals if you want high quality metal. I, yeah. There are five specters left in the cow shed. I guess this is. There's two of them. That thing's huge. Okay. Uh, uh. New version of one after two years. It only exists. Do the. Oh. The speech bubbles are enemies. A uh, new version of one after two years. It only exists due to the download link for the old version not working anymore, and as such, only has a couple updated sprites. Oh man, that sucks. Um, we got more silver flesh. I oh, here's the silver flesh. Recovers competency points. Belial's meat cures all negative status alterations. Okay. Got it. There's another specter over here. Let's hit it. Um. Oh, shit. Alpha's blinded. What are these things? Just... Alpha's level 3 now, okay. There are three specters left. Here we go. I'd better heal Alpha, actually. He's a luck ticket. Not the speech bubbles. Get him out of here. There we go. There are two specters left. Okay, I see one. Where's the other? Okay. Get this thing out of here quickly. No, don't blind me. Connie, ah, oh, shit. Batter's blinded. There's more of them. There we go. Okay. 
There is one specter left. Um, where is it? Is it down here? There it is. Oh, it's a, it's a boulder puzzle. <laughs> Fun. Uh, okay. How do I do this? Oh, okay. Like that. Teleport back to the... No. I guess you can do that, but I don't want to do that yet. Alright. Just absolutely murder these speech bubbles. The cow shed has been purified. Okay. Oh, there's the Queen's Inspector. I, I, I am really quiet, you pitiful bastard. No, I, yes. Has it been long since you went inside? I, I don't know. No, of course, you know nothing. I should have known. He, he will eliminate the specters. How does he think himself capable of destroying those stupid phantoms? Thinks himself better than you, better than the Queen. No, no, I, I don't think that. Shut it, I didn't ask for your opinion. We we'll all think you're more intelligent than the others, but you're all the same. Oh, okay. Who the hell is this? In any case, this is hardly important. Phantoms will erase that conceited individual. Um, I got news for you. Oh, that's him, huh? I see. I, uh, you think he won't? Of course not. Nobody here is capable of fighting the phantoms, apart from the Queen's officers. If only you listened to me more often, you wouldn't keep making fools of yourselves. But, but then who, uh, who's going to destroy the phantoms? I could have done it. But you don't deserve it. Oh, okay. Too bad for you, you'll just have to take care of your problems yourself. What the hell? I... Okay. I... I... No. Please. I'm leaving now. Returning to Alma. At least the people there are polite. They don't constantly cut you off. You... Sir, you are the one who's been... <laughs> you are the one cutting people off. Like, but please don't. Goodbye. Okay. Out of my sight. Oh, no, I. I beg of you, get the fuck out of my way right this instant if you want to keep your position. Oh. Who was that person? I'm an asshole. That's who it was. <laughs> You're alive. Yes. And inspectors? The cow shed has been purified. Uh, you. You must be very lucky. Who was that person? That was Tatan. He's the Queen's inspector. You mean Spectre? No. The Queen wouldn't employ a Spectre. He can't be one. But he's evil. Yeah, he's fucking evil. <laughs> I mean, I mean, have you seen him? I must destroy him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, we do. That uh, it's an envoy of the queen. I, I, uh, you better go complete your work in the smoke mines, please. In any case, he's an Alma. No one can go there without proper authorization. So, please. Return to the smoke mines. All right. Yeah, no, I... I do not like this man. I prefer working here over the smoke mines. At least you benefit from the outside air. 
I'm just gonna get attached to the animals. Once you are, it's difficult to put your hands inside. Excuse me. I, I'm not even going to ask. What is this? But was that? Was that dope fish? Wait a minute. Was that a cameo? Was that a dope fish cameo? It was. <laughs> I see. Nice. Okay. Um. I guess we got to go back to the smoke mines. It's getting dark in here. Uh. I don't like where this is going. Oh, random encounter. Let's hit him. Okay. More luck tickets. Oh, there's two of them. Jeez. Mystic socket. Oh. No, they're producing more of these. Good. Target these first. Oops. Didn't mean to do that. Hit these. Hit the giant ghost so we don't die. out of here. Nice. Thanks, great. Mine's gains 90 credits received. Silver flesh. I guess that's one. Um, I'm assuming there's more. More Abaddon's meat. Just blocks. Okay. Guess we... Oh. Do these things have names? Like, like these specters? I, I really want to know what that thing is called. Probably? I see. Better G level 4. Run with courage. Hmm. Let's see, what is this? So wide angle, analyze characteristics, restores HP. Oh, you know what? I haven't been using the... Uh, the analyze. The big guy is named January. I see. Stores HP. Special attack of the element metal. Oh. Saturated string. Special attack with low impact. Right, I should probably be using wide angle because I haven't been doing that. Two luck tickets I've been found. There's another specter. Let's see. Look, let's get rid of one of these things first before we wide angle it. Don't want to take all that damage from domestic socket. All right. Wide angle. Fat specter. Baneful ectoplasmic incarnation. Light resistance against smoke. I see. Oh shit, okay, Alpha's gonna die. Well, maybe not. If I can just kill the fat specter. Alright. Uh, blinded. Oh boy. Okay. Now I need to... Yeah, l let me heal here. There we go. Oh, it just says Fat Specter. Okay. So these speech bubbles don't have names. Okay. 
immediately. Okay, what are these things called? Street Trail was appropriately named Ah. Uh, okay. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. Magnolia, a floating severed head. Light weakness against meat. Oh, shit. Okay, the batter is, uh... Let me, let me, let me heal real quick. There we go. Okay. Let's keep going this way. They we're already here. Okay. Hey, Chroma. How are you? How have you been today? One ticket received. Okay. So I guess we don't have to worry about uh, luck tickets. We should be plenty good on those. You're well enough? Okay, that's good to hear. Yeah, I'm I'm doing well. For the most part. I was attempting, uh, I think earlier today, I was attempting the uh, Golden Strawberry in, in Celeste, and then uh, it didn't go too well. But other than that, I'm okay. Expected Bracket has been acquired. Which one? Uh, the one in Chapter 1 B-Side. Yeah, that, that's the one I was uh, struggling with today. Can never do the peace side straws, yeah. Um, I did, I did manage to get to. Do you think they're harder than the seasides? Yeah, yeah, that that would make sense. I did manage to get both of the uh, golden strawberries for for a side though, uh, including the uh, the winged one. I'm thinking I may, I may hold off on doing any more golden strawberries until, until I complete the seasides. Yeah, because it seems like, uh, seems like that might be a better approach. Oh, there's January. Let's see. Let's analyze this one. January. Ghoul with a dusty breath. Light weakness against metal. How has off been so far? It's it's been interesting. Like yeah, you uh. In this world, you harvest cows for, for metal. And. You breathe smoke. Yeah, that's... That's how this world works. It's, it's quite a setting. Definitely antiquated in some places. It's a really special game, yeah. I am enjoying it so far. Alright, um... Oh, can we access that locked door yet? Let me go up this ladder first.
Let me see. I haven't checked this area. <laughs> Once you've extracted everything from the carcass, you slice it up into pieces and eat the meat. What version am I playing? This is uh, version 3.0, the latest one. Extracting scraps of metal from cows isn't what I prefer. If I do my job well, maybe I'll be transferred to Alma. It's half of a cow. <laughs> yeah, uh, it sure is. Oh, there's the train station. Let's see. Is there a... Uh... Is there a save point somewhere so I can heal? I think maybe it's here. Are there more people here? Go back to the mines. Shouldn't destroy the specters in the barn. The inspector seemed upset when he left. There was an unfortunate bit of dialogue coming up that was corrected past 3.0. Ah, I see. Yeah, this is the latest version, so thankfully I don't have to worry about that. Alright, um, I think... I think the door down here... Um, no, it's still locked. Okay. Uh, maybe more of the uh, the mine can be accessed. Let's let's check. Hmm. I think I was already in this part though. I'm gonna have to worry about the uh, magnolias, I guess. Let's see. Or was this the area? Was this the area that was blocked off? Or is there something else here? Maybe I'm missing something. Because... Yeah, I did clear out the, uh... Oh. Is it these things? Do I have to kill all these to proceed? I'm not sure what else I have to do here. They seem to pop up regardless. Um, oh, I missed. Do they pop up regardless? Like, okay, there's a barrier in the way. It's been a bit too long for, for you to confidently save. You don't think it's any matter more than finding the way forward here? <laughs> um, okay, I see. Like in this specific area, like would you say? Yeah, I, I have. I have not played this game until now, so I'm not sure where to go. Somewhere in the mines. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, so probably not in this area, I would assume. Yeah, because it, it looks like I did everything here. I guess I need to go back. Yeah, I'll, I'll head back now. Yeah, this... I guess it's uh, somewhere in the previous part of the smoke mines. Let's see. Yeah, maybe an area has opened up somewhere, I'm not sure. Uh, there was a train station I I skipped. Was I supposed to go there? Like a... Like right past the part where they were carving the cows. Oh, okay, I see. It might be it. Alright, um... Alright, well, I guess I don't need to be down here. Alright, I'll head back to the train station then. Yeah, I guess that's the uh, that's the way to go. Let's get these out of here. Okay. Let's go to the train station. Spot of grinding doesn't hurt. Things get a bit tricky later on. Ah, I see. Th that is true. It, it doesn't hurt to grind. Um, Alright, let's go here. They say the names of the metro stations coincide with the names of important people of the past. I have trouble imagining that things weren't always the way they are now. Okay. Select your destination. Elson or Damien? I think we were at Damien, weren't we? I guess we go to Elson. Charming number one is very useful means to transfer to different areas of zone one. It doesn't hurt to grind unless unless you grind too much and trivialize every fight. Man who grinded too much and trivialized every fight multiple times. Oh. Let's see, Damien, Pentel. Okay, so this is this is where I was. I think I'll I, I may as well save here. Let's I guess we go back to Damien. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that, that is true. I'm the leader of the Spectres? Oh, it would be great if that was possible. It would be great. Soon I might be promoted. I'd be able to do surveillance in Alma. Anxious for that to happen. Um... Okay, so... So, it looks like there's an item box in here, but... I don't know what... I don't know what's going to happen in this game if I if I take it. So yeah, I, I think I'm probably just gonna leave that alone. Yeah, I don't want to. I don't want to potentially steal this person's stuff. My inspection personnel. Okay, so yeah, so we're back at the entrance to the mine. Maybe there's something here? Okay. Let's check this area out. Okay, so this is where we came in. To the mines. I don't think I've... Have I been here? I don't think I have. Okay, yeah, this is a new area. Oh, what are these? These are new. One-Eyed Spectre. Cunning into plasma incarnation. Light weakness against metal. Hmm. 
você. Overgrinding while trivializing every fight does also let you kill something who shouldn't be killed for no real gain other than saying you did it. I mean, bragging rights is a, it's a reward in and of itself, isn't it? Right? Lots of people do things for bragging rights. Like the golden strawberries in Celeste. It's the best reason to do something. Exactly. Exactly. Scorpio orb. Um... What are these orbs? Is a Virgo orb and a Scorpio orb? Hmm. And to make credits, luck to get Capricorn Orb. Alright, what is. I guess we collect all these? Orbs are stat boosters? Oh, okay, I see. What's what's this one? Libra orb. Sure, a lot of stats here. What do they? Let's see. What do they boost? Okay. Uh, Libra increases character's competency. Scorpio increases attack. Capricorn increases esprit, I guess. Virgo increases agility. I see. Orbs are fun shapes you can use to cast spells in real life. <laughs> That is true, they, they let you do that. Pondering my orbs. Better is level six. Furious home run. Hmm. What could this be? Special attack with low impact. Hmm. Gemini orb. What's this boost? Defense. Okay. this one. Taurus Orb. Yeah, Taurus Orb increases max HP by 50. Ah, I see. Hmm, was that it? I was already here. I guess they just ambush you. Con continually. So is that all there is in this room? It's just, uh, it's just orbs you can collect? Hmm. Okay, so I already checked that one. Um, I think I checked the ones down here. Yeah, I checked that one, and then... I'm pretty sure I did... Yeah. I did all of these. And then I did that one, too. Hmm. So... Let's see, is there anywhere else to go? 
think I did a lot of the uh, a lot of the mines already. Pretty sure I did. Yeah. Maybe I'll head back to the train station? I'm not sure. It's it's a little hard to tell uh, you know, what exactly to do here. Um, did I go straight ahead, I think? Yeah, I did. I went straight ahead. So, is there really nothing else here? Just... It's just orbs? It seems to be. I, I guess this is a, a good grind spot. I mean, if nothing else. Alpha's level 6 now. Hmm. Yeah, no, I, uh... Doesn't seem to be anything else here, so I guess I'll go back. Save. Let me try going this way again. There ought to be some answers here. So like at some point do at some point do uh, weaker enemies stop giving you XP? Like or do they just give you less? Like I'm not quite sure how. Okay. Don't think so? I... okay. The door is locked from the inside. Because hmm. I mean, it looks like January still gives you 170, is that right? Yeah, it's, it's a little confusing. Um, I think we just go back. Yeah, I, th I think there's a... Uh, there is this one other game I want to check out at some point. It's a um, space funeral. Okay, some of you may have heard of it. See, let me. I guess I'll head back to the train station. What is. Okay. Well, that's a different room. Alright, I guess we head back here. Let's go to uh, Pentel, I guess. So not very many things here. This this goes back to the mines. Space funeral is a mess. Not derogatory, but maybe close. Uh, okay, so I was already in here. Because 
Or just because I want to, like, more of this. That's the main reason I want to play it. Just like, uh, okay, so we were here. Adversary taken by surprise. Very fair, yeah. Uh, okay. This barrier blocks the way to the tunnel. Yeah, but feel free to, uh, like, if anybody knows the way forward, feel free to uh, chime in if you, if you have an answer. Because I'm a little lost. Doesn't seem like it leads anywhere. There's no door here. And this door is still locked. Some credits left to get. Yeah. To open that door, interact with the torch that's not glowing. Um, is it over here? Oh, here it is. There's a strange switch on this lamp. A door opened. Okay, here it is. We're safe here. We'll have to attempt to leave once we're out of meat. Maybe open the door. Switch is going to attack us. Leave. Leave us right now. Head outside visitors in the main galleries. Okay. So, what is this item here? Three pieces of Belial's meat. Okay. So that's that's all you find in there. Hmm. Okay. Well, sure, but... Okay, so you can get some items, but... It's a little room. Well, okay, but how do you move forward? Because... Because I'm not quite sure where else to go from here. Okay, so Elson just takes me back to takes me back to the beginning, and then Damien I was already there. So not quite sure, not quite sure where to proceed from here. Hmm. Then I was already here. So, there's another torch that isn't glowing. Okay, I see. I hit these things. So, would you happen to know the uh, the way forward from here? Because, yeah, I'm not sure where to go. Step away for a moment, any progress? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not quite sure where to go, because... Let's see, I... I purified the barn, I... 
I went into that little room, like the one where it's locked from the inside. And I'm not sure where else to go. Been a solid five years to play through this. I think you're in the right area. Okay. I'm gonna try to look it up. Um, yeah, sure. Yeah, go ahead. And apparently I'm in the right area, but it wouldn't hurt to make sure. Give him a okay. Alright, thanks, Chroma. Uh, in the meantime, I will fight these things. Down from here. Okay. I will try that. Batter is level 7. Okay, so I go down from this way. Alright. Okay, so... So I went down. Oh, there's a switch here, I think. Okay. Alright, I flipped the switch, so... Oh, you know what? I think that barrier's gone now. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that was it. Thanks, Mango. Um, right, what do we got here? <laughs> the characters are starting to pile up, aren't they? Pardon? <laughs> Zachary, I see. What I'm saying is that the average player doesn't need all these complicated and tedious dialogues. There should be more action and fewer questions. Who are you? The original Scruggly. <laughs> I'm Zachary, the traditional items merchant that's necessary to every video game. I'll often find myself in places you're going to visit before you. But enough talk. I'm not one of those protagonists you have to listen to for hours. So why not let me see the color of your credits? <laughs> Need anything in particular? Let's see, what have you got? Luck ticket, Molux meat. So he cures poison. I. Analyzes enemies' characteristics. Herald bat. Audacious symbol. Aura of justice. Nicholas tunic. Radius epidermis. Okay, so we can buy some equipment. Let's uh, let's grab some. I would like one. And then. Aura of Justice. Defensive equipment. Defensive equipment for the batter for add-ons. Okay, so I guess I better take these. The Nicholas Tunic and the Radius Epidermis. Yeah, one of each. Poison. Um, I guess I'll take a, a couple of those. I haven't, I haven't met any enemies that'll that'll poison me yet. But I guess I'll take a few just to be safe. Um, and then I think we're good. Anything else? Um, sell. What can I sell? Auras and tunics and epidermises can be equipped at the same time. I see. Let's see, what do I have right now? <laughs> Let's see. Did I... okay. Did I actually buy any of these? Doesn't look like I did. 
Oh, defensive two. That's what that is. Radius epidermis. They all have specific slots they go in? Okay. Aura of Justice. So we grab two of those. Auras are defense one, tunix epidermis is our defense two, colors are defensive three. Okay. Noted. of justice. Alright, cool. Got ourselves some equipment. Uh, let's let's go through this door. Huh? Wait, what? How? Where did you come from? I come from the smoke mines. But how? What? But that's impossible. Not a single lamp works in there. You you can't. Faith guides my steps. Faith? My mission is to purify the mines. It would seem that the phantoms are particularly numerous. The inspectors. Where am I here? Um uh You are here at the plastic administrations of Shachihada in the north of Zone 1. Plastic administrations, uh... Our work consists of filling in forms. Afterwards, we package them and wrap them up with string to send them to the courier service. There, they ship the packages, and in exchange, we receive parcels full of plastic. There's a lot of liquid plastic that forms our lakes and oceans, and then there's solid plastic used to make various objects. Okay, um... It's an essential element, the first among... So... The, uh, nobody can seem to agree on what the uh, first among the four elements is. Um, first it was supposed to be smoke, uh, and then it's metal, and now it's plastic? Feels like, uh, nobody can really agree here. But it's one of the four, I guess. It's smoke, metal, and plastic, so... What's the other one? I guess we'll find out. Because without plastic, the world would be limitless, and people would keep walking and walking without ever stopping. The first what? Like, an essential element. The, the first among the four elements. That's, that's, that's what they tell you. But, but you hunt the specters? Really? Yes, I'm purifying this zone. Like the game around us. <laughs> oh god. <laughs> the first among oh man. Oh, I didn't even notice that. <laughs> the specters. I know where they come from. They all come from the post postal servants? The postal? So yeah, that's that's what I'm asking. That's where we take care of sending the packaged forms. The problem is that uh, nobody can remember the floor where it's found. Well, that's a bit of a problem. But I, I guess we take the lift. Choose your floor. Uh, okay. Basement. There need only be there need only be one brainwormed person between us. True. How's off? It is interesting. Like 
it's a very interesting game. I'm I'm having fun with it. Let's see. Um Actually, hang on one second. Uh, does it ever become on? Um, no, but it does become one. Like, yeah, apparently there's a, a fan game of off called one. Let's see. Um, the roof? I guess we go to the roof. Let's see. Roof. Oh, it's the cat again. Okay, hang on. Alright. What is the... What's the cat got to say? By Joe, you again? You are decidedly everywhere. One could even believe you were following me. But your footsteps... Oh, hold on. I skipped that by accident. Perhaps you are already aware of this, but it happens to be that the Floor Housing Administration's Postal Service is haunted by ectoplasms. It would, most, it would be most judicious to find the story where all these intangible monsters arise from post-haste in order to slay them. But could it be if this task is too arduous for your narrow mind? In which case, I might perhaps be able to provide you with advice. Well, I, I mean, I, I just got here, so... Some help would be welcome, I feel. Open widely open widely your ears and listen well, for I will not say this twice, not even amidst the most pathetic pleas. In one of the four rooms on the ground floor, the employees inside seem to be trained under particular directives. Additionally, if there was a choice to be made, I would choose the lower case over the upper case. That is all. Well, okay then. I guess we go to the ground floor. Choose the lower case over the upper case. Oh, okay. Form 80589, stamp 42371. Um. One nine six seven five stamp. Um. I. I'm not sure what's happening here. Um, form two five eight four stamp ten two five eight. Excuse me. Two five eight four stamp ten two five eight. Form two five eight four stamp ten two five eight. Two five eight four ten two five eight. Form 50324, stamp 58444. 87666, stamp 2584. 84238, I don't know what's going on here. And I can't seem to reach the other employees. 48879, 68300. Choose the lower case over the upper case. So, I guess I have to try these numbers? I guess that's what we're supposed to do here. 37393. Three, 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 nine, three. I guess I'll try that one. 37393. Three, three. What is this? Various offices. Um, 
Worm 36622, stamp 96591. 37183, 69004. 56640, 38296. 15423. Um, 21886. This, yeah, I, I'm not sure what's going on here. This is uh, a little much. Okay, well, that. The floor's different. Stamp 99936 153536 Stamp 77047. 52316. This. How do I find a solution here? Like. Like, it, it just seems to be giving me a lot of these random numbers. I have no idea what they mean. One, one, two. Is it this? One, one, two? That just takes me. I'm, I'm so confused. Like, is, is there, is there a pattern I'm missing? Two eight nine six six. It's the only room without multiple of these workers walking around. It seems like. Wait, the number has changed. Four twenty forty four. Kinda. Eight three three seven five. I'm, yeah, this, because I'm, I'm just not sure what these numbers mean. I shall give it a, yeah, I, I would appreciate one. Because the judge said something about, uh, Taking lowercase instead of upper. So I guess I go with the, the stamp numbers. Yeah, I, I don't know. I'm I am very lost, so if you have any hints, I would appreciate them. The only non-garbage data is on the ground floor. So I just have to try one of those numbers. Are these randomized? Six seven eight nine eight. Nine four six one eight. It's not just random guessing, I see. So do I have to talk to them in a specific order to get the right number? See, I also can't seem to access... Oh, wait, yeah, I can. The order doesn't matter. Okay, so... I just... Do I just have to, like, talk to everyone here? Hmm. 
Form 21260, Stamp 59522. 95980. Make note of the numbers they give you. Okay. I'll, I'll try that. Let me go ahead and write this down. So, do I want both form and stamp? I'm assuming. Form 44405, stamp 25835. Think so? Okay. I'll try it. If the numbers are random each time you talk to them, think about what happened if you talk to the right one. Oh, I see. Okay, so... Form 84326, stamp 96798. Like, presumably, if you talk to the right one, the number wouldn't change, right? Exactly. Right. Let's see, two, five, two, three, two. Two, three, two, eight, three, four, six. And a lot of them seem to be giving me random strings. And two five a. Oh wait, is this it? Stamp ten two five eight. I think this is it. Let's try it. Ten two five eight. There it is. Postal service. Thanks, Mango. No one. Okay, so can't reach that box. Uh, climb the batter. Where are the phantoms? I'm, I'm very afraid. Help me. Oh, what is that? Burnt. Employee of Zone 1 and poor health. Yeah, that's... That's an understatement. Maybe... Maybe it's his suit that's taking control of his... His brain. Strange. Oh, okay. Floor 10258, Area 1-2. Postal service. Something strange is written on this form. First version. They lie six feet under, surrounded by hot metal and liquid plastic. Six feet under, surrounded by hot metal and liquid plastic. Oh, there's more of these. Second version. They are eight, and they have long beards. They watch what is happening from their high silver spheres. Okay, um... I guess we... I try looking upstairs or downstairs? I'm not sure... What's this? Oh, okay. An Aura of Justice. Well, I already have that. 
So it was just a way to the item. Okay, now what are these clues for? Third version. A sole big insect whose mandibles spit meat. Adversary taken by surprise. Nice. What's this, the fourth version? Fourth version. They are four, each one attributed to an element. They protect their respective crystals. Let's see. This looks like uh, somewhere you progress. So, let me check this one. It's the same area. Fifth version. Five, like, their, like the fingers on a hand. Their lungs produce primordial smoke. What's this one? Number six? Last version. There are but two in the secret zone. Um, uh, access to the secret elevator is uh, forbidden. Did, did I say secret? I must pass. Uh, uh, really? No, uh, I think that's uh, impossible. Unless you... Uh, have the code? I... Uh, no, that's... It's not the code. There's a... Okay, so there's another code? So what is... What's this? Tibbers. A flying ghoul with bad intentions. The numbers from the versions, I see. Gotcha. Okay. Alright, let's type in that code. Four, five, two. The code, it is, it, it is exactly correct. Oh, how? You, you must not pass. I don't want to die. Going to Alma. Will be nice. Floor the director's office. Oh, it's a safe point. Is this a Pitiful bastards disappear this instant. This is my zone. You are not to be here. Oh, there he is. The L Center View. Uh, out of my sight, you fucking phantoms. You. It's you, the source of all my troubles. The ectoplasmic lord who has set his fucking sights on my beloved zone. What do you want? I've be decided to be such a pain in my ass. I've dedicated my whole life to this place. You have no right to corrupt it with your pathetic phantoms. Be gone. You're mistaken. I'm not a phantom. I'm a purifier. I've come to cleanse the world of these ecto ectoplasmic beings. How dare you respond? How dare you think I will just swallow these insults? Listen well, this is simple. Get out of here and take your goddamn specters with you, or I'm going to kill you. I hope for your sake that I've made myself clear. If I see you again, you're dead. The tramway will now stop in the Alma. Okay. I guess we descend to the ground floor. Oh, okay. Can only return to this room through floor 10258. 
I guess we go back. We go back to the uh, the tramway. So I, I'm guessing. Oh. I'm guessing we're gonna have to fight him at some point. Converted string has been acquired, okay. Oops, I think it's up here? Yeah, it's up here. head this way. And the tramway should be up here. Here we go. Oh, we can stop in Shachihata? He's actually the only enemy from now on. <laughs> well, that sounds more concerning. That there are There are several of them. So, Shachihara. Let's see. I don't think I was here. The Queen's General has an office here, but his real house is in Alma. Okay. Oh, that's what this is. Okay. I never went to outside of the building. I guess we go to Alma then. All right, let's go. Um, I, I'm not allowed to let anyone pass, unless unless they answer some questions. Okay, what are your questions? Two of them come from Jerusalem, and. Two of them come from Jerusalem, and the third from Orda's Oda or Orda or Vienna. I don't think I've heard this one before. Two come from Jerusalem, and the third from from Vienna. I'm I'm not sure. Maybe Vienna. The Holy Trinity is made of roses, crocuses, or winds. Um, winds? Is it winds? I'm not sure. Our Lady wears jersey number four, six, eight. Wait, are, are the answers like, like right next to me? They're. I, I don't. Eight? I, I don't. I don't know. How many threes are there in June? What? What? Uh, I. How many threes are, are there in June? I. 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 I have no idea. I don't even know what this person is asking. I'll just... Cyril, Kevin, and... Charles? I, I I honestly have no idea what these questions are, or if you get context for them. Charles? One or more of your answers... Yeah, I... I imagine they were. What is this? How does this? Let's see. Up, down, observe, left, right, previous, next image. Okay, March, the month of the winds. Week 11, 2007, 288 days. Fourth Sunday of Lent. St. Cyril of Jerusalem. 
let's see, Jerusalem, Surreal, Surreal, and Porta. Saint Kevin, Saint Charles Ongan's Companions, not the June, Month of Roses. Oh, how many threes are there in June? I see. So there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Looks like twenty-one. Oh no, twenty-two. Because there's one down here. February, month of crocuses. Okay. okay. Crocuses, roses, winds. Month of the month of the winds, month of roses. Okay. Sixth Sunday of the year, Our Lady. So six. Okay. Um, I think I kind of get it. Third from Orta, I believe. Holy Trinity is made of roses. Let's see. Our lady, where's six? How many threes are there in June? There's 22. Alexander. Okay, let me let me take a look at these again. March, month of the winds. Fourth Sunday of Lent. Okay. Two come from Jerusalem. Okay. So the third from Orta, right? There are 22 threes in June. Sixth Sunday of the year. We have Lourdes. Let's see. Roses. Okay. I guess I need to examine this more closely then. Because I'm missing something. If I'm getting it wrong. Two from Jerusalem, the third from Orta, right? Twenty-two. Six. Kevin, Charles. Okay. St. Cyril, St. Kevin, St. Jonas. Okay. I think I get that? Let's see. What's that? Roses. Six. Cyril, Kevin, and Jonas. All your answers are correct. Okay. But uh, there is one more question. If you turn the month March upside down, what two-digit number can you read? Well, 30, right? You, you would think, right? Oh, unless there was something else I forgot to analyze? No? Okay. March. Oh, 81. Okay. Okay, you don't have to answer the other ones, thankfully. What? It's not? If you turn it upside down, was there something I missed? Okay, um... If you turn the month March... March, upside down. What two-digit number can you read? So... 87? I don't know. Oh, that is correct. Okay. Right, right. Okay. Yeah, that does make sense, actually. My nails are all dirty. It's red here. Yeah, you, uh, here to say. Here to see the dawn. Um, yes, 
Yes, of course. Oh. Uh, what is this element? You are here in the meat fountains of Alma, in the center of zone one. There's a little seven on the map. Oh, okay, I see. So, meat? Is, is this another element? Here, meat flows freely, endlessly filling these immense metal pools in which we find ourselves. Our work consists of pouring this meat into bottles before the fountains overflow. The meat is then sent to everyone, to those living in Zone 1 and the others. It's an essential element, the first. Okay, so I, I guess we know what the four elements are now. It's um, uh, smoke, metal, uh, plastic, and meat. Those are essential elements. There are four of them, and they're all the first. Well, I'm sure, but, but what does this mean? Without meat, people had nothing to eat, and they would devour each other. He has an office in the center of the fountains. Nobody has ever found it. Generally speaking, he only seem, seems to only appear when necessary. Well, uh, there. Who are you again? Come to liberate the world of malignants. Oh. Oh, really? Uh, well then, can you liberate me? Oh, okay. Well, since you asked. Yeah, because my thought was that uh, one might be seven, up, like upside down. I didn't think there was a, a seven on the one. I, I wasn't. I wasn't paying attention to that. <laughs> I'm not sure. In good form. Perhaps you have some credits to spare? Let's see, what have you got? Um, persistent symbol. Sorry, it's nice that it's something you can stumble into, yeah. Um, color of Wrath. Oh, here's the color. And, uh, what else? Persistent symbol. Alright, let's go ahead and equip these. Color of Wrath. And persistent symbol. Um, okay, so it looks like we've hit the, uh, the two-hour mark, so... I'm going to go ahead and save right here. Yeah. I'm going to save and now... Okay. Well, I'll save one more time, just to be sure. Okay. So, I'm going to go ahead and find somebody to raid. So, let's see who's online. Um... Let's see, it looks like a uh, looks like a uh, Rake Oscuro's online with uh, with We Were Here Forever. I'm not sure what that game is, but we'll go ahead and say hi to him. Thanks for streaming. Have a good night. Thanks, Chroma. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Let me go ahead and set up the raid. Rake Oscuro. I think I spelled that right. Yeah, I did. Okay. So, oh, let me also tune in and head over to his channel. All right, so thanks everybody for watching. I hope it was entertaining. And I will see you all next week. Bye, everybody. Oh, yeah, hold on. We need a raid message. We'll say... Uh,
this. This will be our raid message. All right, I will send you all over now. Let's raid. <laughs>